you. Uh, uh, <laughs> well, thank you guys very much. Uh, I'm originally from uh, Milwaukee, Wisconsin. It's about right. Uh, you guys are like, oh, that's what they look like. <laughs> uh, originally from Milwaukee, live here in uh, Los Angeles now, and I, I live in kind of a uh, dangerous neighborhood. Actually, there's a Hispanic gang in the area, uh, or as they like to call themselves, uh, cholos, uh, which sounds like a delicious snack treat. Uh, sure, it's like a deep fried pastry, you put sugar on it. Uh, that's a churro, turn that into a churro. Uh, do not put sugar on a cholo. Uh, <laughs> It'll confuse them for a minute. You can make a run for it. But uh, I'm at the, uh, the grocery store the other day. I see one of these uh, Cholo fellas. And he's got one of these uh, teardrop tattoos. You ever seen those? Which are, are just adorable. Uh, but my buddy says that means he killed somebody in the joint. Yeah. But you know what I think it means? I think it means someone needs a hug. <laughs> Turns out I was wrong, did not want to hug. Uh, yeah. Be careful of the gangs, folks. I don't know if you know this. If you're driving at night, you see someone with their headlights off, do not flash them with your headlights. It's some sort of gang initiation, right? They'll go after you. So now if I'm driving at night, I see someone with their headlights off, you know, I, I shoot them. Uh, <laughs> safety first, you know? Uh, <laughs> all right. Ah. Uh, Let's see, so uh, living out here, I actually experienced my first earthquake a few months ago, and uh, a little embarrassing, right after it happened, you know, right away, I started looting. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> things are a little awkward around the apartment complex. Uh, <laughs> I'm having to return items to neighbors. Yeah, I thought that was a big one. I, uh, <laughs> I thought there'd be no survivors, to be quite honest. Uh, I don't know what a 3.2 is. Um, <laughs> Here's your cat. Um, so uh, let's see. I do come from a, a long line of uh, show business people. Actually, my great great grandfather was actually a Civil War reenactor uh, during the Civil War. Uh, a little ahead of his time. A little ahead of his time. Uh, my parents are uh, my parents are older, uh, older, older than me. Uh, if your parents are younger, you're probably adopted. Um, <laughs> But they are old, and uh, growing up, they were very homophobic, very homo, I'm sorry, they're very homophobic. They hated words that sounded the same, but meant something completely different. <laughs> different. <laughs> uh, so, uh, I, uh, I, now, the, the gay marriage, they approved that finally, and uh, I'm assuming, I'm assuming we're all against it. Uh, all right, so, now I, um, now here's my thing, I like gay people because gay people get to call their loved ones partners, you know? Like they're detectives or something. <laughs> like, I'm Troy, this is my partner, Randy. <laughs> we're gonna solve this murder. <laughs> then we're gonna do it. Oh. <laughs> Take it easy, Randy. Um, no, I, uh, I'm not a very smart guy, I was kind of a dumb kid. And uh, like I always had trouble with math, like, uh, like the multiplication tables. So what I would do is I would associate the numbers with things that I knew. So, so take the problem like seven times seven, I would think seven castaways on Gilligan's Island. Who was the star of Gilligan's Island? Bob Denver. Denver's in Colorado. When you think of Colorado, what do you think of? Mountains. Mountains in Spanish is montañas, which is spelled the same as Montana. Who's the most famous Montana? Joe Montana, who played for? The 49ers, yeah. yeah uh, that, that'll work for any math problem. Uh, I, had, I would do another one, but there's no, no time. Um, no, I, uh, I like to have fun, folks. Here's something fun you can do. Next time somebody calls you and it's the wrong number, here's what you do. They ask you for someone who isn't there, you ask them for someone who isn't there. So like, is Bill there? Like, no, is Todd over there? Hey, thanks for watching. Be sure to click subscribe to see even more great Conan clips. You may now return to your pirated movies and creepy Japanese pornography.